Hey guys, welcome back. So uh, we're gonna head out and do a little bit of shopping and get some air. As you can see, there's a lot of people out. I'm also gonna give you some quick numbers. Uh, sick in China, 22,196. Recovered, 55,545. Fatalities, 3,073. Uh, in our province of Ningxia, we have four sick, 71 recovered, and no deaths. So that number went down from our last report. So uh, enjoy the video. We're going to walk around a little bit. And we're going to do a special video on Tuesday. I have to go to the health clinic to get my yearly physical exam for my work permit. Okay, and also I want to tell you guys, even inside or outside of China, it's better to be safe than sorry, so wear a mask, make sure you wash your hands and do all that good stuff, all right? And we'll see you guys later. Enjoy the video. Very good, Timothy. You can see in no place, so there have a many, like this is noodles, the egg here, from farm. Eggs everywhere from farm. Like here too, all from farmers. So you can see there's a lot of uh, fruit and vegetable vendors. And I have to say our city is doing really a lot better these days. It's apples. Apples and you've got uh, oh, different. pineapple. All from a farmer. Yeah, eggs, watermelon. If later have a police, they stop this. Yeah, oh, look these at that guys kitchen. Are not Chicken. To do kitchen. This. Chicken. 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 Chinese people have a hard time with the word chicken and kitchen. Each one they clean them uh, maybe 100 RMB. RMB. That's $15. $15. Pineapple. Strawberries and watermelon. All right, so you, you guys were we enjoy the fruit and vegetable vendors. But once things get back to normal, the police are going to uh, get rid of them because they feel that it makes the streets look dirty and bad. Yeah, they want to but actually, clean. actually, I really like it. <laughs> I really enjoy it. You know, the smell of fruit when you walk on the street and being able to buy it here or there. I like that stuff. Sad later they will be gone. Yep. Look, these tomatoes so good. But they are cheaper. Tomato, small tomato, and the flower. We could go to the store again. Yeah. Here, show them this. <laughs> yeah. So this is for roasting and cooking nuts and seeds. And what happens is when they break the seal, it sounds like a bomb. bomb. It goes boom smoke and you'll see some smells so good but it's really really cool and it smells really good yeah you can see another store here see, 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 see. Oh, America's favorite cookie Oreos but the cookies in China have 18% less sugar because Chinese people don't like sweet food yeah, as too much sweet as American is not good. so they're okay they don't taste as good as the American ones, but they're okay. I teach you the Chinese word, the right is here, look at that. Ao li ao, ao li ao. Yeah. Here are, some, here are some Lay's chips, okay? And they have generally different flavors here, pure spicy flavor. These are a little bit more spicy than even the spicy chips in the States, okay? But you've got all different flavors here. These are similar to Pringles. They're not bad. And uh, what else? Similar to Funyuns down here, banana chips and things. They have a lot of dried fruit. These here are actually not bad. I like those. I like, the, I don't like all of them. Yeah, these Any are like them. Andy Cap, the hot fries, and you know. He can make people fat, I don't yeah, like. Yeah, Chinese people have a thing, they're really worried about getting fat. Yeah, especially me. Obviously, this is a Pepsi. There's the Chinese brand. This is one liter for 60 cents, okay? Pretty big bottle for a good price, so I'm gonna get two. Just under five pounds of bananas for two dollars, okay? Not a bad deal. 
We are home now. Today, a lot of people.